If you've ever wondered how to get started in the stock market or felt overwhelmed by all the jargon, don't worry. Today, I'm going to break down the basics of the stock market and walk you through everything you need to know to start investing with confidence. Whether you're looking for tips on the United States or Chinese stock markets, the latest stock market news, or just want a better understanding of the stock market for beginners, this video has you covered. Let's dive in. So what exactly is the stock market? At its core, the stock market is a place where people can buy and sell shares of publicly traded companies. Think of it as a marketplace where investors trade ownership in businesses, and the value of those shares can go up or down based on a variety of factors. Stock Market 101 When you own stock in a company, you own a piece of that business. And as the business grows, your stock can become more valuable. But it's not without risk. The value can also drop, so you need to invest wisely. Okay, let's talk about how to start investing in the stock market. First, you'll need a brokerage account, which is where you'll buy and sell your stocks. You can open an account online with platforms like Robinhood, Webull, or even a traditional brokerage like Vanguard or Fidelity. Once you've set up your account, it's time to do some research. Look into the companies you want to invest in and check their performance. As a beginner, it's always smart to start with companies you know and trust. Let's cover a few basics of the stock market that every beginner needs to know. First is diversification. Don't put all your money into one stock. Spread your investments across different companies or industries to reduce risk. Next is risk and reward. Every stock has a level of risk. Generally, higher risk means higher potential rewards, but also higher potential losses. Lastly, there are dividends. Some companies pay out dividends, which is a portion of their profits shared with shareholders. It's a great way to earn some extra income from your investments. One thing to keep in mind is that the stock market is impacted by news and events from around the world. For example, the United States and China stock markets plays a huge role in global markets. If something big happens in the United States or China, like a government policy change or economic shift, it can affect stock prices everywhere. Make it a habit to stay up to date with stock market news. This helps you make informed decisions and understand why certain stocks are rising or falling. There are plenty of apps and websites that provide live updates, so you're always in the know. All right, let's wrap up with a few final tips for beginners in the stock market. 1. Start small. You don't need thousands of dollars to get started. Even investing a small amount can grow over time with compound interest. 2. Do your homework. Research the companies before you invest. Understand their business model, profits, and long-term growth potential. 3. Stay patient. The stock market is a long game. Don't panic when prices dip. Keep a steady hand and think about the long term. So that's your beginner's guide to the stock market. If you're ready to start investing, remember, knowledge is power. Keep learning, stay patient, and your investments can grow over time. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and drop any questions you have in the comments. Let's grow your financial future together.